Hi everyone, I'm meteorologist Danielle Kozlowski and I'm here with Roto Curve to give you guys a forecast for the Monday night baseball games. Um, good and bad news, there's only eight games, which means we don't have many to really look at. However, there are a handful of issues with the games that we actually have tonight. So that's kind of unfortunate. Um, so Two of the two games that I'm really most worried about are going to be uh, Cincinnati and uh, Pittsburgh. So as you can see, we've got a whole bunch of severe thunderstorm watches and tornado watches out along uh, the Ohio River Valley in the Northeast. Um, thankfully, neither Cincinnati or Pittsburgh are included in those. However, that does not keep them out of the woods for thunderstorms. Um, as you can see on this overview on the SPC page right now, this eastern portion of the country is pretty much just lit up with thunderstorms um, all over the place. And that's kind of going to be the story for the next few hours um, through the afternoon and evening until um, the sun goes down. So kind of a zoom in of the Ohio River Valley Northeast area. Here we've got Cincinnati and then Pittsburgh just to north and east of it. Um, this is a plot from SPC Mesoanalysis um, of CAPE, which is the convective available potential energy, which is um, one of the parameters that we use when forecasting for severe weather and thunderstorms. So Pittsburgh and Cincinnati definitely have their fair share of it, around 1,000 joules per kilogram. Um, but we're going to kind of have to keep an eye out on that. The winds aren't super strong to um, really produce super severe damage, so hopefully it'll just be delay of game and not actually postponing. But as you guys saw, there are a ton of thunderstorms out and about right now. So um, I'm going to go back to this because this gives a little bit better view. So here we've got Cincinnati down here and Pittsburgh up here. And as you can tell, there's storms moving through Pittsburgh right now. But this line back here um, in Indiana and Ohio is going to be um, affecting western Pennsylvania here over the next three or four hours again. So hopefully Cincinnati will just be a rain delay um, and a late start for a little bit and then they should be in the clear, fingers crossed. But Pittsburgh, my guess is that it's probably going to end up being postponed. This game just doesn't look very good weather-wise at all whatsoever, especially so it's 4 o'clock out there right now and game time is at 7.05. Um, so it's got a few hours to clear out, except that means it's got a few hours to clear out for these thunderstorms behind it to um, kind of intensify and progress eastward. So good and bad. Um, definitely that will be the one if you're on the line of trying to play someone or not. Definitely um, keep that in mind. I don't think that it will be good at all um, if you're trying to bet a lot for the Pittsburgh game because um, it's not looking so hot. But those two were really the main ones. And then for the Cincy game, hopefully that it won't get delayed. Um, but the winds there will be 10 to 15 miles an hour uh, out of the southwest blowing out to left field. So keep that in mind also. But that is my forecast for you guys. And I just want to wish everyone good luck. And remember to follow us on Twitter at WeatherDFS. Good luck, everyone.